Hello, this is Jaden with Adventure Pilot here with another quick tip about checklists in iFly EFB's 12.2 update. So firstly, if we go to the bottom right, we'll see this new Tools tab, which is actually replacing the Sketch tab. So now we have Sketch, Weight and Balance, and Checklists all located here. So we'll click Checklists, and we'll create a new one. And now we get a sample, Cessna 1 in 72, or we can create from a blank list. And there will be more samples like this that you can pick from in the future, but they're just default, generalized checklists for this aircraft. So we'll click Cessna 1 in 72, and we can change the name, but I'll keep it the same. And click Done. So now we're at our Editing Checklist menu. And if I collapse all, you can see we have all our sections here for our checklist. And if I need to add one, I can add a new one down here. And I'll actually open Aircraft Acceptance. And say I want to add a new item, like pitot static check. So I'll type it there, and I'll click Done. And so now we have pitot static check at the bottom. But let's say I want to add the second part of my checklist, so I can click Reorder. And now we'll select, in order, uh, the items that we want on our checklist. So first we'll have Control Lock, and then we'll have pitot static check. And then we'll go through the rest, keep the, everything else the same, and we're done. So now we can see pitot static check is up here in the second slot. And so let's say I go through everything else in our checklist, and usually you obviously specify this towards your aircraft checklists. And so once we're done with that, we'll click done. And now it pops up our final checklist here. So let's say. I'm going through my checklist, so I can select everything in here. And once I do select everything in here, it will automatically close and open the next section. And so we can go through all of these, or if you just want to check it by eye, you don't even have to select anything. You can just open the new one, and it'll bring you down and close the old one. So looking through, it looks good. And if you just want to select them all at once, you can ch click this gear icon and click check all. So let's say I'm done flying. I go through everything. Everything's checked in green. After about a couple hours, around 24 hours, it'll actually automatically clear all of these. So let's say it's the next day I open checklists. All of this would be clear and not green anymore. And it's really easy to just clear them all anyways you just click clear at the bottom here and you can also restore it to whatever you had in case you accidentally click it but that's about it for checklist guys i hope you found this quick tip useful and i hope you have a wonderful time flying bye now